Five years. How can it be five years already, folks? The joining together of Birmingham Women's and Birmingham Children's Hospitals. Our fifth birthday. What an achievement. When I was thinking about five, I thought of five-year-olds. And those of you who had children, you know, you've gone through all those different ages, all the terrible twos and the, all those things, all the teething problems. And it wouldn't be right for us to celebrate today without acknowledging that it's in part been a hard five years. COVID has not made it easy for us. The, the fantastic way of which we've come together, we can't ignore, it's been without its teething problems and it's important for us to acknowledge all the sacrifices and the commitment that all of our staff and the knock-on effect to our patients and our families that it's had. But we're here. And like a five-year-old of finding their own way in the world, of growing up, of finding their own identity, that's what BWC is doing. That's what we're celebrating. And we come here today to rejoice in that coming together. And many of you before Christmas may remember the sad event of Bishop or Archbishop Desmond Tutu dying and so many tributes. And the Archbishop of Canterbury said of him, the world was a better place with him in it. And that really struck me. And I want to bring that thought to us today in our reflection that Birmingham is a better place for the coming together of Birmingham Women's and Children's Hospital. That maybe even England, the UK, maybe even the world is a better place for Parkview and FTB and the women's and the children's and all of the different facets of our care of coming together for the last five years is a better place for us joining together and we look forward to many more years ahead. <laughs>